Hey guys, um, okay, if anyone watches this, then, you know, I'm not gonna respond to any comments or anything because I'm actually doing my makeup. Um, I accidentally broke my mirror and, um, I have this mirror, this big thing. Okay. I have this that I could use. Um, and I was trying to, like, hold it and do my makeup and all that stuff, but I figured, oops, sorry. I figured it would be easier with my um, and so that's what I'm doing right now if I can get the camera to stay up. So I'm going to use you guys to do my makeup. So, alright, I already put on like a base stuff as you can see. It looks like I don't have any zits, but of course I do. Like they're all over the place if you look really hard. Um, but, you know, that's the nice thing. One of the nice things about makeup, I already put a powder on. So my complexion is all even out. I'm sure I'll get tons of, oh, you look pretty or whatever. Um, but since I believe in proactive humiliation, this will be like, like, this is the good part. And I'm excited. I have a reason to put makeup on. I'm seeing a friend who I haven't seen in a while. And um, I'm excited. And so I have a reason to want makeup on. But I don't have a mirror. So I'm using the camera. And um, yeah. So here I go. Wait. Okay. So I went to Sephora um, with my daughter one time. And um, they, like, they were doing some kind of eye. I'm trying to figure out how to get the eyeliner where it does the cat eye kind of thing, you know, but she put mascara on before, um, before, sorry, I can't talk and do my eyes at the same time, um, before, like, whatever. Oh, she put the mascara on before she put my eyeliner on. And, um, I was like, oh. And that makes sense, though, because the eyeliner is kind of, like, it gets on your lashes, too. My mascara of this type, I think, is running. Like, it's drying up. Oh, wow. It's got to work. Um, but I noticed that, that you do the eyeliner first. But, um, apparently, no. Apparently you do mascara first, which makes sense, like, with the liquid iron and that stuff. Um, it's, like, crazy. If you zoom in on some of my prior videos, like, the ones from a couple days ago, because you can see my eyebrows. Like, I took my eyebrows and everything to this. I feel so accomplished. Because, like, today I'm trying. And sometimes it's fun. Like, sometimes it's fun just to, just to dress up. It's good to, um, it's good to be comfortable without it. You know, be totally comfortable in your own skin, you know. That's important. But it's also fun and important to see how how beautiful you know um, your skin and the rest of you can be if you give the right attention. Plus, like since I'm old and stuff, um. A lot of older women tend to start getting themselves go. And I think the whole, like, you know, guys say it's letting themselves go. But I believe it really is letting themselves go. It's letting themselves go and set themselves free from all of the crap. <laughs> like, wait a second. Why am I putting on makeup? Like, what? What's the point? Why am I dressing up if, if pajamas are the most comfortable thing? Um, that's what happens as you get older. It's not that you're letting yourself go. Well, it kind of is. It's, you're letting yourself go 
back to reality. Yep. That's what I believe. You guys should follow my cult. I think that was always my backup plan. I used to have a blog. I still have a blog. It's out there somewhere. You can scroll back through the years of my life. The blogging, blogging really set me free. Um, because at the time of blogging, I was in, I don't know, I just, I was in a really bad state of mind where I felt like the things that I do or don't do were never good enough and I really, I felt like my kids would be better off without me. I felt like, like the world in general would be better off without me. I was, I was very depressed. Um, and so, like... I'm glad, I don't know what I was getting at for sure, but I know I'm glad that, um, that I let myself go. I let myself go be who I was, who I was meant to be, which is this, which is me. Like, I don't usually have makeup on, as you can tell, I, I don't usually, um, like, I do care about my outfits, <laughs> um, but it's not in the traditional wannabe fashionable sense. It's a, in a, um, I got socks, and I want them to match the outfit sense. I gotta show you my outfit now. Because I found a shirt that my ex-mother-in-law had, um, bought for me many, many, many years ago. Um. I don't know if you do this either. Like if any people out there, you guys should tell me what you do when you're doing your makeup. Um, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to remember kind of what the girl was doing and she did that, I think. <laughs> like that's the thing that sucks about my memory. I mean, I, get, <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen like I didn't know it was gonna happen but I had a feeling like especially a couple seconds before it happened oh I should drop the thing right then I've been trying to learn how to listen to my gut and the more I try the better it's getting and um so yes right then my gut had told me like a couple seconds before to that I was gonna get mascara on my nose it's just happen okay so yeah I have to learn how to trust my gut you should too I try to like all the time but it takes practice I'm so glad that I didn't make a video of this Instead, I'm just going live because it would have taken forever to upload. Um, I suppose I could just use the camera and not actually record it or anything. But, you know, why not make a video? Join it. See what people's ideas are. See what you guys think. Like, see how you do your makeup if it's any different. Anything. Help me figure out how to do the the eyeliner thing because I got well I'll still try to do that and all but I was trying to oh you know I have a comb I have a comb that's what I'll do okay so now I'm going to like pile even more on this side because it's not looking quite as huge as the other that's a nice thing about this mascara it's kind of a little um I don't know this thing um, it is good when you can like build, build it up all of a sudden and then hopefully my eyelashes won't all fall out. I want to wash it out. It's sad. If you are like a burn victim or something, and then I think your eyelashes, like a lot of burn victims eyelashes all burn out. But, um, I wonder if they come back. So, burn victims, tell me, tell me, do your eyelashes and stuff grow back? Or, if you rest your eyelashes to, like, some other, 
like weird things and you should tell me about that too because I'm curious so do it <laughs> now let's see like, come on I have to be careful because like hold on now my intuition is telling me that I'm about to get it like one on my under eye and then I don't even know, like I'm about my elbow. I gotta, I gotta make sure, yeah, I can see. Yeah, what is that? Okay, so I'm going to like try to reposition. So my elbow feels a little bit more stable. No, I know, I just called that intuition, you know, but, um, Perhaps it is God. Perhaps it is nothing. Perhaps it is just like a gut feeling. Perhaps like whatever you want to call it, it's all the same thing. Different names for the same thing. That's what it is. Okay, so now I'm going to try to. Oh, well, I guess the camera is over here. I'll work. Okay. Um, but what I really want to do. Um. Is. The cat eye thing. But I don't know. Every time I try to do it. Like. It looks stupid and I wash it off and start out. Okay. I touched my. Like. Just barely touched my. Bridge of my nose. I, I, um, I like hang out. Um, okay, so now I'm gonna stop with the mascara because it's um, gonna have to work. And then I'm gonna comb it out, make it all pretty. Because I remembered that my eyelash comb is in here. I have a little zip plug bag with all my makeup. Um, because I just carry it around that way if I go out to um, the country and then I have my makeup with me if I stay here then um, it's all like in one place I'm not bringing it everywhere I used to bring it in this little bag and every now and then I'll still throw something in the bag but um, not Yeah, that makes sense. Be here in what's on. Yeah, I just need to do the little eyeliner. I think that'll be good, but um, I keep looking at the wrong side. Okay. I'm moving my head the wrong way. I need to be doing laundry, but I'm putting it off yet another day. Because I have stuff to do. Okay, put this back in the bag before I forget. Um, okay, what's the next thing? Oh, eyeliner. See, this is the thing. I have liquid eyeliner. I'm gonna try it. I'm just gonna try it. We'll see what happens. But every time I even try this, I get it. Whoops, I'm trying to bend the, the thing down so I can get my wheelchair close enough. I have the table on table risers that, um, but I can, I still need to like sneak into it. Okay. See, this is liquid eyeliner, which I get, I thought, oh, well, that'll be good because 
pretty easy and stuff, but it's not, it's not that easy. Um, let's see. How am I going to do this? Okay. Oh no. Wait. Hmm. Where is a good spot? Good spot for the camera. Um, let's try. Maybe I can, okay, and now I'm going to have to back my chair up a little bit. Alright. There. There we go. Okay. Now, like, people just do a, a like, um, I would fail to surrender custody of my children too, but I mean, I know that there's a reason why. <sighs> but that's sad. It would suck to have to go on the run with your kids because the state wants to take them away. That's it. Okay, so maybe, I don't know, what do you guys think? Nobody's even here. Am I, yeah, I'm still alive, but that's cool. I'm glad nobody's here because um, then it's just like I'm making a video to upload later. So, um, huh, it's pretty good, right? Like, I don't know. I don't know how to do like the very... Oh, I should put some eyeshadow. Should have done that before that one. Huh? I don't know. What do you do with the eyeshadow? No, you put it on after. Okay. I'll do that to kind of help disguise all my mess ups. Yeah, oh, that's not bad. Okay. Pretty good for, you know, me. <laughs> like, I suck at eyeliner. It's hard because sometimes my hands shake and then um, sometimes I just drop the little thing and then there's a million reasons why I suck at eyeliner. But that looks okay. I think I sh I'm supposed to do like a little bit on the bottom. But I'm going to do the other eye. Or try to do the other eye on the top first. See if, if I can do that. Okay. Maybe that's how they do it. They just do like a little line. Oh well, I mean I kind of messed it up because I want it a little bit messed up. Maybe that's what they do though. I don't know. I remember, I read like makeup stuff a long time ago when I was a little teen. Okay. Yeah, see that doesn't look like human though. This one is more dark, like the other eyes.
Watching justice. It's good. I like that note. Okay, and then I think I'm gonna just do do eyeshadow for the rest. Oh, I have to work for the eyeliner because it scares me, and I can't. I don't know. It's not gonna look even. All this stuff, like, hopefully it looks okay. Now, I need to um, do a little bit on the bottom. So, I'm going to start with this side. Kind of okay. I'll blur it a little bit in a second. Okay. That was horrible. But it's hard. Okay, so. What fingers are for? Mm -hmm. Should I get one of those like beauty blender things? Okay, let's see. I think it's gonna be like that. I haven't seen him in forever. Yeah, that worked. Okay, I have to get um, the eyeshadow from another room, so I'll be right back. Try to get this little holder. I'll be back.
could find one thing that I was looking for and I forgot what the other thing was. So, anyway, um, I forgot. Now, what was I doing? I was gonna do... Oh, a high shadow, that's what it was. Hold on, I'll be back again. Okay, I'm back. I remembered the eyeshadow this time. That's one of the many things that talks about having a really poor memory. And I think I'm going to change this shirt. Either that or, like, roll the sleeves up, maybe cut the sleeves off. Um, yeah, actually, rolling them up will work better. It just feels, like, too big and bulky. Um, so, yeah, maybe that'll work. But, I don't know. I might just cut them off. But, anyway, let's see. What? Or... Okay, so I'm going to use eyeshadow that kind of matches the shirt and or sock since I got this awesome eyeshadow thanks to an awesome person. So, um, let me try. Whoops. That's the ceiling. Okay, um, eyeshadow now. I'm trying to not drop the phone. Okay, um, the eyeshadow, like, you're supposed to use two different, right? So, darker one um, on the crease, and then the lighter one all over. So, I think I got it. Alright, I'm trying. Yeah, I think you're supposed to do the dark along the lash line too, right? Along the lash line, along the crease. Oh, it says, apply a light shimmer base over the lid and softly blend it upwards. Concentrate on the shimmer in inner tear duct to brighten eyes. Oh, okay. Use medium, apply it to the crease. Not, uh, they have all these instructions and I'm like, I'll follow the instructions. They say put a lighter, apply a light shimmer base over entire lid. But I don't think this is a shimmer. So hold on, I'll try it even lighter. Okay. Which one is the lighter one? <laughs> I already like put that darker shade so it might not turn out exactly like I'm gonna try this other eye my um, naked eye I gotta scoot up just a little tiny bit too okay that bad, but I feel a bit of the fifth Okay, I keep mixing up the shade. Oh, I know I'm a little bit. 
like it's getting off course. Okay, well, I think that's a light shimmer base over the entire eyelid, right? Okay. Alright, now, softly blend it upwards. Oops. Concentrate on the shimmer on the inner tear duct to brighten eyes. Okay. I'll put some shimmer on the other, like a little bit more shimmer. Right around my tear duct. Nope, nope. I'm doing a little bit on the, the inside of my eye. Okay. You see how I'm shaking? Shaking. That worked. Okay, so now what? Um, it says use a medium mauve shade and apply it in the crease. Take the rest of that color to blend upwards for a soft look. And then with the dark, I just want to do that. Look. Well, this is pretty dark though. Apply over mauve color, concentrating on the crease. Softly blend the dark shade to the bottom lash line. For smoky eyes, okay, but I don't need to worry too much about that. All right, where did I put the side I already touched to the darkest shade that I'm using? Okay, um, My arms should probably take a break. I'm doing makeup for a while. At least my body's in different, different ways, but I just want to get this done while well. I'm already, I'm already concentrating on it. Might as well finish it up. Okay, let's see. Can I see myself now? Oh, no. What do you think? So, 
that too feels kind of like, like one eye might be a little bit darker. It's hard to tell because the light is so bad. And my hands are just not going to work very much longer, so um, I better wrap it up on that. Now, I was going to find, um, I was trying to find a different lipstick, but I can't find it. Um, so I'm going to try this stuff that's in this makeup. It's red. My friend likes red lipstick, so even though it doesn't match it quite as much, or if I mix the red and purple, it would probably be really cool. But it's not like this is, um, like I don't even know if this is actually lip stuff. I think it's like blush or whatever. my teeth first anyway before I do that. So I'm going to end this and um, I'll see you guys later. Bye.